Much has been said about Nintendo's fall from grace and its declining sales. Their stock has taken a nosedive. Yep. Um, their projections for uh, making a profit throughout the year, they were going to originally do uh, a pretty sizable profit. And now they're going to lose $240 million. And while all of this is true, did you know that Nintendo has over $10 billion saved from profits they've made in the last 100 years? That's quite a lot of money for a failing company. Not only that, they have over $6 billion in properties, equipment, and investments. What type of investments, you may be asking? Well, Nintendo of America is the majority owner of a little-known baseball team that you might have heard of, the Seattle Mariners. All in all, if Nintendo was a country, they'd be richer than 80 other countries in the world. And that's not even calculating the fact that they have some of the most valuable intellectual properties in the entire gaming industry. Franchises like Mario, Zelda, Metroid, Pokemon, Donkey Kong, Animal Crossing, Kirby, Smash Brothers, Mario Kart, Star Fox, and many, many more. And how about the cool little handheld device they've been selling like hotcakes? The 3DS is it. How much would you think that Sony and Microsoft would pay Nintendo for exclusive rights to the Super Mario franchise? 50 million? 100 million? While the Wii U is without a doubt struggling to keep up with its competitors, I think it's safe to say that Nintendo isn't going anywhere in the near future.